Making sure there's oil in the truck is not my responsibility. What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to Breaking Truckers. Making sure there's oil in the truck is not my responsibility. This guy says, making sure there's oil in the truck is not his responsibility. No more wasting time. Let's get it. Hold on. Well, no, because that's not my job. Uh, when I take the truck in for service or to get oil changes and stuff like that, that's when they're supposed to make sure that there's enough oil in the truck. Making sure there's oil in the truck is not my responsibility. Drivers, what's your thoughts on this, man? I, I need to know. Somebody help me out with this guy, man. Somebody help me out with this guy. Bro, how could you not know that checking the oil is part of your pre-trip, my man? It's part of your pre-trip. When you get out in the morning before you start your day, you check you, you, you check the engine, you check the oil, you check the coolant, you check your antifreeze, you check all of that. You check everything from the front all the way back to the back of the trailer if you have one, my guy. How could you not know that checking your oil is part of the pre-trip? Making sure there's oil in the truck is not my responsibility. See, I understand you one of them, you, 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 you doing this stuff for clout, man. You talking nonsensical? You you just doing all this just to get the, the to get a reaction because that's exactly what you're doing. You can't be serious. Who gave you your CDL? It had it, it, it had to be the company that you just left, Western Express. It, it, it had to be CR England because they give CDLs like like candy. Who gave you your CDLs, bruh? When you go and test out for your CDL, part of the pre-trip in order to test out now is to check the oil in the truck, in the engine. Making sure there's oil in the truck is not my responsibility. But see, you one of them I don't give a who drivers. One of them I don't care drivers. I just want to get paid drivers. Just let me drive down the street drivers. So whatever the case, if I break down, if I don't break down, it doesn't matter, driver. But see, when you break down, you're not making no money, driver. Bro, this shit fucking up so bad. And I'm stuck because I just stopped at a rest area. Oh, my God. What the fuck is it doing? Bro, I just stopped at a rest area for like five, ten minutes. And now this shit's shaking and all type of shit, bro. I'm like, it won't move. And, and part of that is making sure that your truck is on the upkeep. That's, that's part of it. That's part of it because if you break down, you're not going to make no money. Oh my fucking God, guys. It happened again. I stopped to get fuel and now I got all these trucks. Got to go around me because I'm blocking the fucking entrance and the exit to this loves. Oh my god, this is so embarrassing. I'm about to get back here and just fucking lay down uh, until this record gets here because this shit is not moving at all now. This shit is just turning right back off. It's just doing that shaking, jumping thing, RPM jumping up and down, and then it's just t shutting back off. So I can't even move it. You're just going to be sitting somewhere cashing in that $50 breakdown pay, and that ain't shit, bro. Who gave you your license, man? Because this isn't for you. But see, I understand you do these TikToks for clout, man. That's all it is. You want a reaction. But I'm going to tell you something, my guy. This isn't for you. It isn't. Making sure there's oil in the truck is not my responsibility. You're going to, you going to get in or cause an accident that's going to, that's going to hurt somebody or, the, or, or else kill somebody, bro. This isn't for you. Whatever you was doing before you got in the truck, and man, you need to go back to it. If you was an inspiring rapper, you need to go back to it. If you was inspiring Burger King, McDonald's, you need to go back to it because this isn't for you, my guy. You need to stop, man. Stop playing. That's the problem with y'all TikTokers when y'all get into this industry. Y'all not taking this serious. You're not. You just think that this is a game, man. All you TikTokers over there, y'all think that this is a game, and it, it isn't. 
It isn't. All y'all want to do is get in the truck, make TikTok videos while y'all driving down the street, make TikTok videos, dancing and all like that, making TikTok videos to, to, because you're playing in the truck and all like that. Y'all ain't taking this serious. Y'all not. Y'all, y'all newfound drivers that's coming into this industry, y'all, if y'all was taking this area serious, if y'all was taking this serious, you wouldn't be doing the stuff that you be doing, man. Making sure there's oil in the truck is not my responsibility. You wouldn't. You need to get out. You you need to get out. Get out. Sorry, man. Okay. Get out! Yo! Yo! Chill, man. Get out! Chill! Get out! Chill! Chill, man! Get out! Chill! Get the fuck out of here! Get out, bruh. Get out. Get out before you hurt yourself. Get out before you hurt somebody, my guy. Get out. Sorry, man. Okay. Get out! Yo! Yo! Chill, man. Get out! Chill! Get out! Chill! Chill, man! Get the fuck out of here! Just, just get out because this right here, you're not focused. You don't pay attention. And and most of all, you play too much. And when you speak on trucking, you really need to keep your mouth shut because you don't know what you're talking about, bro. Making sure there's oil in the truck is not my responsibility. Okay, not changing the oil is not your job. <sighs> or checking the oil is not your job. I don't know. I, I, to be honest with you, I'm, I'm not even understanding how you last this long. I'm like Beethoven with the bass on it. Me, classic kids, that went pop. Death to the hater won't stop. Let's talk key scales, it won't drop. You don't even need a scale to know I'm on top. Me and Mozart, could bars, you got pops. Heard you writing Tiffany, a whole symphony. You a symptom, me, but go off. Or make a masterpiece for you, or at least it's gonna hit like rump, bump, bump. Y'all fit to me like the symphony. Your career's done, done, done.